This is SAT practice test three, calculator question number two. It deals with individuals who entered a contest and they're categorized by age and gender. If the contest winner is selected at random, the question is, what is the probability that that winner is either a female under 40 or a male 40 or older? In these problems where you have a table with two categorical variables, I like to write my probability as a fraction numerator over denominator. And that helps me to organize my thoughts. My denominator is always the number of individuals who could be chosen as described by the words of the problem. And College Board may ask for one or more columns or one or more rows, or they may ask for the entire table. In this case, they say if the contest winner is select, selected at random, there's no restriction on who could win, so the denominator of the individuals who could be selected would be all 25 who entered the contest. Now we need to find the numerator. Of those individuals in the denominator, which in this case is everyone, how many are either female under 40, so that would be female and also the column for under 40, so that's these eight, or a male age 40 or older. Male would be this row, but we only want 40 or older, which is these two. So our numerator of the individuals who are either female under age 40 or male 40 or older is 8 plus 2, so that gives me 10 over 25, which is answer choice B. I strongly recommend rereading the question to make sure your answer answers their question. And they were saying if the winner is selected at random with no restrictions, what's the probability that the winner is either female under 40 or male 40 or older? And that is what we did. So choice B is the correct answer. Come back soon for my next SAT math video. With math, there's always more.